I have an iPhone SE 2020 version. I'm going to show you how to take a screenshot and also how to take a screen capture, basically taking a screenshot of an entire web page, okay, instead of doing it like one by one or, or sections of it, okay? Very, very simple. So the, first, the easiest way to do a screenshot is a two-key combination. It's going to be your side or power button and the home button. You want to press and hold both these buttons together. Press and hold, just like that. Just tap it, both buttons, okay? Every time you do that, it automatically gets saved into your photos gallery. And then what you can do from here is just tap on album down here and you should have a new folder. If you just scroll down, it should be called screenshots right here. Those three screenshots I just took, they're all right here. Another thing to note too is when you take a screenshot, you can edit it right away too. So if I take a screenshot right here, now we can go ahead and tap this picture right here. And then you can go ahead and you can crop it. You can go ahead and you know you can uh, write things on here. And then we can go ahead and click on done and then save the photos and that'll save it directly to the photo gallery and the screenshot is right here, okay? Now, let's say that you're looking at a web page. Let's open up Safari here. And now you see this web page here with all this information. And let's say you want to send this or save this or send this to somebody. Instead of taking like multiple, a bunch of uh, screenshots, what you can do is this. We're just going to go ahead and take a screenshot right now. And then we're going to tap down here. And now you see this little, uh, it says full page, full page right here. If I tap on that right there, now, we can go ahead and we can capture a screenshot this entire web page. We can also go ahead and tap on crop if you want to crop it out. Okay, I'll go ahead and keep this all this the whole entire web page. Let me just click on done and I have to show you this too. I'm gonna to click on done and the only option here is save PDF to files. Okay, so let me go ahead and save PDF to files. That's not your photos gallery. That's your my files app. Okay. Anyways, from here. The default name is right here, um, Google helping, or I mean, you can go ahead and, and you can you can rename it to whatever. I'll just rename it to test. I'll click on done here and I'll click on save. And now where did this PDF go? It doesn't go into your photos here. It goes into here. You have to go and look for files right here. Tap on files and then oh, sorry. So tap on files and then tap, you just tap on recents right here and then you can see that Last one I just made test right here, and then that's the entire web page. Okay, so pretty simple. Any questions, issues, uh, just comment below, right?